Oh boy, I'm excited for the comment section on this one. These were the hot and cold connections for a washing machine. It looks like at some point that hot water line had leaked in the slab and someone rerouted it with a 3 8 line. The homeowner currently did not want to reroute the entire line, so we worked with what we had. To all of the service plumbers out there, I'm sure you'll know how that goes. I originally got called out to the home for the valve on the hot water side leaking whenever the homeowner was trying to install their new washing machine. The idea behind all of the work that I'm doing here is to be able to install new valves and properly secure them to the wall. With the homeowner not wanting to replace that 3 8 line, I did have to adapt back to it. Definitely not the most favorite connection I've ever made, but sometimes you have to work with what you have. Once I got everything connected to the lines coming out of the slab, I went ahead and anchored it to the wall. Once I got everything secured, I did remember that I forgot to pro-press the drop ear 90s, so I went ahead and did that as well. Right about now is when I moved my camera to record me installing the valves. For whatever reason, it didn't actually record, so I don't have that step.